so in this scenario what and as you know that 70% is with whom with the sarkari banks not only sbi you can say with the sarkari banks public sector banks so what government of india said that we will try to infuse some capital in these banks because if you remember we discuss about the capital adequacy ratio and to reach to this ratio or to maintain at 9 plus 2.5% extra you need what capital because increasing the denominator is easy yes or no but increasing the you know this one is been kind of tough it is not easy okay that's why the government of india wants to help them and they're going to provide how much around 2.11 lakh crore rupees something okay or 2.4 whatever you're saying whatever be the number number doesn't matter okay around 2.4 lakh crore rupees which they want to provide so they said we will provide this money into three ways like out of this money around 18000 crore rupees will be paid by government of india to these banks directly in the form of cash okay do you remember it just a proposed one how the thing is actually going to work we'll get to know about this in future okay they said around 18000 crore rupees they are going to you know simply provide them in the cash to the sarkari banks then around 58000 crore rupees will be raised by the banks from markets so they will ask the banks to go to the market and raise money okay that they have to raise around this much amount of money from the market it could be you know the public it could be the companies it could be the foreign investors also that depends okay they will raise this much amount of money from market and then you can see around 1.35 lakh crore rupees will be provided through a bond called recapitalization bonds okay as per the estimates of the reserve bank of india after demonetization okay indian banks are having almost extra cash of more than 2.5 lakh crore rupees of extra cash they are having okay which is in the form of what deposits they will use this money for the purpose of selling the bond so bonds will be issued by them of around this much okay and that will be purchased by the bank from this money getting a point or not government of india will issue these bonds they will sell it to whom to the banks and the banks will have the bond and the money will be transferred to whom to the government of india government of india will use this money to purchase shares of these banks okay government of india will use this money for the purpose of buying shares in these banks so that they will be able to have capital yes or no samajh pa rahe pa rahe hain jo depositors ka paisa wo kahan gaya government ke paas and then they have used this money for the purpose of buying shares in the sarkari banks so in a way what happened they are being able to raise capital from the market moreover whatever bonds that is to be provided to the banks now imagine in future if the banks are facing cash crunch and the people are being demanding loans then how they going to meet demand of people this bonds can be used by the banks for the purpose of providing as a pledge also to raise money from the market okay so in